Hey y'all, Donna and Grandma here with a, another completion. It has been kind of warm, but from what I understand, we're fixing to get some cool weather, so that will be great. Mississippi has been smoldering. My Milo's zero calorie tea, the yellow top. Um, I have got a completion. And it's for no certain thing. Yes, I did work on it this month. But I've been trying to get it done. This is for Bo, my grandson. It's for his room. And, um, I, ooh, ain't nothing like hearing drills. Ooh, y'all hear that? Ain't nothing like the drills being pressed down into a, I always roll mine. Sorry, y'all. I had rolled it earlier, but I had found a spot where I didn't have some locked in good down here on the bottom. Let me make sure I hadn't. I've got a black bead, and I'm going to make sure I ain't pulled it off somewhere. But anyway, this is one I am so excited about. It turned out great. This one come from GBFKE. And I unboxed this one not too long ago. And uh, I was looking to see if I had pulled this out anywhere, but I don't see an empty spot for it. I probably will here in a minute, but I don't see one. And y'all, this one is a 50 by 60. And I had to cut some of the edges off around it so I could get it on my light pad. I worked on this one out at Mother's. And uh, anyway... This one I have got to seal, and I have got to get it put on a canvas. But y'all, I love this one. And he is going to have a fit when he sees it, because he is all about the marbles and all about DC. He wanting to do his room in Fortnite and marble and DC. So here we go. This is all of them right here. You can see it looks very good. I am so excited. I think it turned out great. It will look good hanging in his room. I am going to paint a canvas black because I do not have a black canvas, but I can paint one black. I have black paint to put it on. But y'all, it turned out great. Did not have any issues other than I run out of some beads, but it was not their fault. <laughs> I knocked my beads off and spilt them. But thank goodness I had some extra ones that I have not put up yet. I had them right here, but I had plenty to do what I needed to do. And um, I about had a stroke. It was three colors. I had put it in one of these right here. Except I had put it in a double. Here it is. I had put it in a double and... I knocked it off and it bust I mean it didn't bust it it all uh, like these little ones it hit some of them hit on the corners and it spilt some of them and I just used what I had and I still had plenty of the other colors as you can see it was just three colors and I had put some black in here because I was afraid I wouldn't have black enough black but I did but I used three colors but it was my fault. It was nothing to do with the company. And y'all know that I like GBFKE. Um, and if y'all don't, di I mean, if you haven't been diamond painting for long, if you don't spill your beads <laughs> at least 10 times every time you work on one, you're not doing something right. I don't care how careful you can be. And you may not spill them on every on every canvas you do, but you're going to spill some. Because I always spill some. It never fails. My husband, when he vacuums, you can hear it going up through the vacuum cleaner. Because, I mean, I'm just, I'm going to be honest with you. If I drop some, I'm not fooling with digging them out of my carpet. Now, down out there at Mama's, Mama has uh, the linoleum floors and stuff. All I do is just pick it up. Sweep it in a dustpan and throw it in the garbage. I am not. And I know some of y'all saying, oh my gosh, but y'all, I'm not doing it. If I don't have the colors I need, I'll wait till I get a canvas that do have the colors I need and use them. I'm just, I'm not, if I happen not to have them, I'm just not going to do it. Because I'm going to tell y'all, 
I ain't all about digging in the carpet and all that stuff. It ain't worth it to me. But I don't have room to keep all these beads. Round, square, and all that. I, I keep them. When they come in the bags and stuff, I keep them. And I've got a whole bag for Diamond Nana. And I've got a bag for Miss Jackie. She wants squares. But I'm not keeping them for myself. I do not. I do not keep them for myself. <laughs> That's just too much trouble. And if y'all keep them, kudos to you. Diamond Grandma ain't got time for all that. I know y'all probably say, well, you can make time. Y'all, when you're a caregiver, that's a 24-7 job. When you have autistic grandkids, that's a 24-7 job. And then try to do your YouTube channel for your sanity. And to work on diamond paintings, I'd rather work on diamond paintings than digging them out of the carpet. I know, y'all think I'm crazy, but that's just the way it is. But y'all get on there and look on GBFKE. GBFKE is one of my favorite companies and y'all I love it didn't have any issues other than something that I did and that's when I spilt my beads but I have enough diamond paintings around and stuff I could find me beads but I just had to get on here and show y'all my marbles my Bo Riley Bebo's we call him Bebo his marbles he is so excited he was so excited when I started working on it but anyway, I'm going to get off of here. If you like what you see, give me a thumbs up. If you would like to be part of Diamond Grandma's family, by all means, hit that little bell. It'll upload any time that you do a complete, I mean, any time I do a video. Whether it's a completion video, a PR package, or anything like that, friend mail, whatever, y'all get to see it. But anyway, I'm going to get off here. I love y'all, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!